The standings don't wait. Playoff positions aren't put on hold. The NBA is about doing the best you can with what you have. OKC's prospects are just fine in the hands of an MVP candidate who poses a nightly triple-double threat. And there is Westbrook's fourth, consecutive triple-double. The Bulls must lean on their veteran front court to lead a hard-working unit. For both, there is opportunity to step up, to assert your presence, to make your team even stronger for the stretch run. We know who's not walking through that door tonight. But look who is. Are you kidding me? And a post-game interview awaits one player who steps up tonight. Thunder, Bulls, Sager. Next. Russell Westbrook, the first player in 26 years with four straight triple doubles, leads the Thunder into Chicago. Bulls are all banged up, but Joakim Noah and company have still risen to the second spot in the East. And this is good for the soul. After a battle with leukemia, Craig Sager, back at work, will be on the sidelines for the first time this season. And the NBA is glad to have him back. Hey everyone, this is Russell Westbrook here. Let's wish Craig Sager a great welcome comeback. Good to have you here. Congratulations on meeting and winning against a hell of a challenge. Uh, our challenge is pale by comparison with what you just did. We're all happy for you. Now, the probing, incisive, profound questions will begin to roll, I'm sure. We're all looking forward to those, plus the fashion statement each week. To show my man Craig Sager how much he was missed on the sidelines, I thought I'd go in my closet and give y'all Sager life. What do you think? Hey, Craig, welcome back. I mean, TNT has not been the same without you. We've all missed you, and obviously now we've all taken the pledge to live the Sager life. Welcome back. Oh, we're, thank you very much. We're thrilled to have you here. We appreciate you wearing our team colors tonight. <laughs> but uh, it's great to see you. And uh, you've been a great inspiration to a lot of people for the way you uh, fought through everything, your courage, your determination. I think it inspired all of us. And uh, we're excited. You're home. That's for yes. sure. Awesome. Go, Craig. Yeah. Cannot wait to. Uh, Sega Vision. Cannot wait to watch this one. It's so good to have Craig Sager back at work. And uh, boy, it's, words don't do it justice. Um, it has been a tough uh, almost a year now. It's back in April when he was diagnosed, and then uh, tough spring and tough summer, and uh, the uh, bone marrow transplant from his son Craig Jr. And uh, now cleared to play and back on the sidelines tonight. And uh, man, we cannot wait to see him uh, back at work. This is cool, man. You know, Ernie, I, and I tell people, and we, everybody said the same things all the time. Uh, turn the, <laughs> hey, man, those moving. cameras move all the time, man. All the time, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's your first time on you know, television. You're a little sure. paranoid. Yeah, you're okay. but, you know, <laughs> I enjoy coming to work at Turner because everybody, you get to know all these guys really well, and it's been a tough time for us going through all this entire thing with Sager. We know his son, his wife, Stacy. Uh, they've been amazing. They're keeping us up to date on all the stuff that's going through. It's great to have him back. You know, a lot of people don't really know Craig like we know Craig, but I'm, I'm sure they could tell by the questions that he has. He's not afraid. So, you know, when he was diagnosed with this, you know, we all were worried and concerned, but I know he was going to beat it. And he looks good. He really looks good. The Blazers looking good. It's, 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 you know, he, 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 he really looks good. So, Craig, welcome back. The, the thing is funny. He, Tom Thibodeau thinks those are Bulls, Bulls colors. colors. Those are not Bulls colors. That's his wardrobe. <laughs> <laughs> I always said that he, he was the, the best at his job asking the best questions to the best players. No doubt. Yeah. And, and, and that's difficult to do. And he, and he carried that out. And he's got a great matchup to come back to Oklahoma City in Chicago. Bulls have all kinds of injuries uh, and still are number two in the East. Meantime, Russell Westbrook joining Wilt Chamberlain as the only players to have 120 points, 40-plus rebounds, 30-plus assists in a three-game stretch. Uh, he's got these four straight triple doubles. The last guy to have a streak like that was Michael 
back in 88-89. Wow. Joins the Big O as the only players to average 30-10-9 for a month. Uh, <laughs> His fourth straight triple double came last night. I don't know how you describe what you're seeing out of this guy, Jet. <laughs> you don't describe it. it. It's it's really an attack and assault against the defense. He is he attack. He keeps everyone on it their heels. Every play. He, in that's the difference. What Shaq just said. Every play. I, you 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 play. We played against great guards, great forwards, great guys who handle the basketball, but not every play that they put you on their heels. Now. Is his, is his decision making changed? No, I don't say it's changed much. His his efficiency has picked up in a lot of areas, but his decision making that we questioned at times is still the same. But his efficiency in making those shots has picked up tremendously, and he's never going to change to be the type of play he was uh, that that a conventional point guard. And, and keep in mind that fourth triple double came um, after missing one game after having facial surgery after he took that shot. Uh, in the cheekbone the other night. You, you know what? Can, can y'all please put the, that graphic up? Not that graphic, but the one up earlier. Uh, they, they can, but uh, uh, while they do, go ahead. No, because Ernie, you just got to look at the names. Yeah. Like when you, it was Wilt, Oscar, and Jordan. Jordan. Yeah. Like when you. I well, don't put the graphic up now. We just well, said. you can put the graphic up because. Yeah. yeah. But it's really remarkable when you put the graphic up and you're like. These are the, Pete Maravich also. Yep. When you, anytime your name is mentioned with Wilt, Michael, Pete Maravich, and Oscar Robinson, that's just scary, Ernie. Yes, it and is. what we're seeing, listen, as much as I love what Russell's doing right now, I'm still going with James Harden for MVP. Right oh, you tripping. <laughs> I'm not tripping Ernie, right Ernie, now. I'm more, I'm more impressed with the assists. You know, Chuck and I have been saying many, for a long time, past couple years, shoots too much, needs to do a better job of getting players involved, but... I think he's actually doing a, a more than adequate job of getting this guy and involved as, as much and as you're, playing his style. As much as you're impressed with the assist, I'm more impressed with the rebounding because I'm like, I know how difficult it is from that position to be out front, guard in the front, guard, and then to go back and rebound and be able to get multiple rebound, double-digit rebounds is sometimes impossible because of where you're starting on the floor to when the shot goes up where you have to be to go get it. It's, it's an incredible feat. The energy, you, know, you you're talking about an energy drink. This is an energy drink right here. This guy is the energy drink. He now leads the league in scoring. He's fourth in assists, and he's he leads the league in scoring. In nope. Yes, he does. He wow. passed James Harden. Harden. Yes, nope. he did. And here, LeBron uh, with a tweet. Miss you very much, Craig. Welcome back. Can't wait to see you. Been too long, swag champ. That's, that's for sure. You know, this is the best time of the year, the NBA playoffs, everybody's positioning, and then we got college basketball. I just got to say this and get this off my chest. I watch a lot of basketball. If I see another <laughs> college basketball coach, no foul, he got a three-point lead, but less than 10 seconds ago, I'm going to go nuts. Some, something tells me you didn't have Ohio State in that game. <laughs> well, I, you, you know what? It, it just, Ernie, that, is, that just drives me crazy. I know it. I you know. got to foul. Celebrating our 10-year partnership with the fine folks at autotrader.com. Uh, speaking of the college game, as you were in that clip, uh, March Madness, the selection show, Sunday the 15th at 6 o'clock on CBS. The first four, Tuesday, March 17th. What? I'm heading to New York. So this starts in March Madness. It's like a real damn job around here. <laughs> Can't wait. <laughs>